<laughs> Watch your feet. Is this a good spot? No one's here and you can't see us. Oh, hi. This isn't a good spot. We don't have light right here. They might be able to see Jenna, but they can't see us. <laughs> no, I Why don't we sit over there? Okay. Put it on that table and just sit like in the... Turn that light on. Well, you can sit in this chair. I'll sit right there. Or turn it over here. Oh, yeah, you can sit Just turn it around. Oh, okay. All right, Jenna. You see how racist she just was? Did she said she my complexion. No, you're not. <laughs> <laughs> What's my mom want? Oh, oh my God. Okay. Hey guys. So I have two guests this week. Oh, I'm Sharika. Y'all remember? Oh, you didn't put. Her I'm Jenna. <laughs> yeah, Jenna's the one who said she was the same complexion as me. Y'all know who Jenna is, though. Oregon girl. 200, Puma, what else? What's your PB? 22.2. Damn. 23 more. <laughs> <laughs> My PB is 200. <laughs> I don't even know what we're going to talk about. I totally dropped the ball. And um, I was supposed to have another video up today, but I left the attachment that I need to edit my video. So, so I ordered saw pieces today. They're being used. <laughs> <laughs> Everyone wants to meet you guys. They always ask about um other athletes on the circuit. Okay. Who's running the four hundred final tomorrow? Um and the race is it's it's USA or Jamaica versus USA since we're in Jamaica. Or is it the other way around? Whatever. It's me Courtney Acolo, Phyllis Francis, Ashley Spencer, and then the Jamaicans have Noveline Williams Mills, Mills, um, Stephanie McPherson, Christine Day, and God, who's that eighth person? I don't remember who the eighth person is running, guys. Like Christina. Did I not say? Oh, I haven't. You know what? Maybe it's Christine. I don't know. That's her event, right? So uh, yeah, it is her. Questions. You have a lot of questions. We are in Jamaica. Represent Someone said, Sun Belt. Uh, "Hey, Red Wolves." Boo! <laughs> <laughs> no, you did not. Uh, hey, don't be putting our locations out. <laughs> We're in Jamaica, but y'all don't need to know where we staying. Um, so ask your questions. Thank you for welcoming us to um, Jamaica, and thanks for the well wishes. Let's see what else is coming through. Jackson. No Francina. Where has she? I don't know. She ha, I, Has she opened up this year, Francina? Mm, I don't think so. Mm -mm. I saw a video of her training, though, but I don't know where she is. <clears throat> Janae? Janae Robinson? I hope I'm saying your name right. If I see you, come say hey. Um... So polite, Miss Hastings, Miss Nelvis, and Miss Prandini. Hey, somebody said, What's your PB? What's my PB? Well, your race strategy. I'm not giving y'all my race strategy. Um, thank you. Yes, I am sponsored by Janet Collection, so you will see me in some beauty supply stores. Nelvis, when you gonna run the 400? <laughs> There's only one Nelvis here. Uh, no. I'm not even doing that. That's worse than the 400. I've heard people say the 400 is worse than the 400 hurdles. Well, I've run both. I've heard that. Too. And the 400 hurdles is way worse. Okay. Well, um, Jenna, someone said congratulations on Guadalupe. Thanks. Um, Thank you. Um, I was there too, guys. <laughs> she ran fast too. <laughs> um, Jasmine wants to know: Do I recommend going pro early? I actually think you should go to at least one year of college. I think the whole high school straight to pro is is a hard one. There's only one case that's been proven successful, and that's Allison. Everyone else is kind of like. I mean, besides that, guys, college was the best three and a half years of my life. If there's a time that I could go back and do over, it is three college. Yeah, I, I did leave early. 
I did it. Like after I had all four years. <laughs> no, I left. So when I say three and a half years, I left after my junior year or I turned pro after my junior year. Really? But then I went back for my fall semester. Ah. And then I, I came back later and finished. But I learned something new today. Yeah. What questions do you guys have for my friends here? Someone said, Sharika is right. 400 hurdles are brutal. <laughs> we love y'all too. Why don't you run the 200? I do run the 200. I just don't run it as fast as Jenna does. <laughs> <laughs> we are having an awesome time in the Caribbean. Hey, let me tell y'all. I feel like they're trying to set us up with this food. The food is so good. She doesn't really like it. <laughs> you don't like it? I do, but breakfast was a little mm, oh, yeah, that... kind of a little fishy this morning. Like it was it fishy. Was... We had mackerel rundown. So <laughs> <laughs> that was that was kind of fishy. It was good to me though. I grew up eating that. What did you think, Jenna? The breakfast wasn't that good. <laughs> lunch and dinner is good. Yeah, lunch and dinner. Lunch and dinner have been good. Yeah, we had jerk pork for dinner tonight. So we had to stop because we got to run fast tomorrow. I run the hurdles but also do sprints. See, someone said the 400 hurdles are easier. Yes, Omega 3. Oh, you can stutter step <laughs> the whole way. I eat curry the goat, but there was way. no curry goat here on the menu. How fast should you come out of the blocks for the 200 fast in order to can. finish the race? You can come out slow and still finish. <laughs> you can. <laughs> you can. That's, that's a personal. Um, somebody said Jenna is so quiet. Don't be fooled. Don't Ooh. be fooled. She's shady, y'all. She's shady. Good luck Touch at regionals tomorrow. Shady. <laughs> <laughs> what, did, uh, what did you major in? I majored in exercise science. What did you study? Uh, journalism. Business and econ. Somebody said what? Good luck, ladies. By joking? Huh? Dominated the field by joking? Oh, I don't know. You are a jokester. <laughs> uh, where in the U.S. can a person go to join the U.S. track team or train to run for the U.S.? Anywhere. <laughs> that's yeah that's a hard question um you have to go to the u.s nationals well you have to qualify for it first um you can't any american can't just show up to the u.s trials or nationals you have to run the qualifying time which do we know what our qualifying times are i know what mine is what is it what for worlds is 12 8 and that's the qualifying time for nationals yeah the standard, yeah, twelve eight. But for the Olympics, it's thirteen flat. Ours is like fifty two something. I have no idea what ours are. Yeah. Like eleven two for the hundred. No, eleven one. Maybe eleven one. Dang, is that? No, 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 it's eleven two. Yes, eleven two. Yeah, it's eleven two. I don't know what the two hundred is. I thought it was two twenty three flat. Twenty three flat. Yeah. You know, I'm not like running any moved. 800s. My endurance is just fine. Thank you. The B standard. <laughs> and so it's only a Yeah, you should run eight. Yeah, right. Or you can do, like... You can try... It would be funny, Sasha, if you did 400 hurdles. Never. <laughs> I don't have enough coordination. Do you don't think you can't get over the hurdles? Uh-uh. They're really little. Yeah, you just like... um, someone said they're a fan of your Snapchats. <laughs> <laughs> um, Jenna, why is Oregon track team always so good? They got good coaches there. Curtis is the man. I like and, Curtis. Yeah, they recruit really well, too. And All the girls are talented. That's basically it. Oh, my God. Look, I was li listening to her interview on the 200... <laughs> I guess you didn't understand what the guy said. And he was like, thank you. <laughs> he was like, he started laughing. Oh, and yeah. Like, I said, oh, my God. What did he say? Was so he was saying something. She was like, yeah. thank you. He said he something to me, but I didn't understand it. So all I said was thank you. And then he laughed. So then I was like, that definitely wasn't the right answer. <laughs> it wasn't. It really was. I, was like, I didn't even, I didn't know what he said either. But I was like, oh my God. That probably was like half so English, funny. half French. I was yeah. Like, mm -hmm. The difference between pro and college is getting smaller and smaller. I, I don't necessarily agree with that. Oh, I hate when I do that. Sorry. Um. Thank you. Uh. Do you guys remember your last prom? 
I do. I went to my senior high school prom by myself. Me too. I didn't. Let me tell y'all, my thing go, me and my boyfriend, we broke up. And so I tried to... Uh, no, I didn't have a boyfriend. Taj, when have you had a boyfriend? <laughs> <laughs> God dang, Taj. <laughs> dang, the shade. <laughs> <laughs> the shade. I wasn't trying to shade you. I really wasn't. But anyway, long story short, we broke up and I tried to change like the color of my dress, but I couldn't. So I was there. We still looked like we still we matched. Go. Yeah, but we didn't go together. So that was funny. Yo, Sharika Sh- just played. <laughs> Somebody said she tried it. <laughs> <laughs> I was state champ. Were you state champ? I was. I was too. Yeah. Um, the boys were scared of your muscles, probably. <laughs> I am vlogging this weekend, so that vlog will be up on Monday. Oh man, actually, no, it won't be up Monday because I don't have the um the thing I need to to do my editing on my flight home. Um, do I have any tips? You run one hundred and four in the four hundred and you're twelve. Hold on, was that um? A guy or a girl? It's dang it. I think that's pretty I lost good the for question. a twelve-year-old. That is pretty good. Yeah, what grade is that? For a twelve-year-old, twelve is seventh eighth, grade. Eighth grade? Is it seventh? Grade I feel like it's sixth or seventh grade. Ten is Not fifth. Sixth grade. Ten is fifth. Yes. Eleven is six. Yeah, twelve is seven. Nope. Yeah, that's good. Um. How much sleep is best before a race? As much as you can get. No, let me not say that because you can't sleep too much. You should get about seven to eight hours. Oh, that's a good question. Which one? Well, dang it, man. If you catch it. So answer it. <clears throat> <laughs> well, since I'm five nine, I think it's a really great idea. Um, for them to, to, the hurdles. to yeah to raise the hurdles to 36 because if you think about it our hurdles go they stay the same in high school college and on a professional level and I feel like it need to be some kind of you know difference because I mean for the guys they go what 39 in high school and then they go to 42 after or or in college and then it stays so so but I it am all for the same it. from college to pro for men or does it go Yeah, up? yeah, it stays okay. the same from college to pro, but they change from, from middle to um, college. Mm-hmm. So, high school, college, and pro women are all the same height? Yeah. Yeah, that's... <laughs> I'm not going to say whack, because I don't have to clear it. <laughs> yeah. But I see what you're saying. That yeah, that but that would knock, like, a lot of the shorter hurlers out, which I'm fine with that. <laughs> what I'm just saying. Just being honest. I'm just saying. <laughs> oh my goodness. Oh, stop. Um do you get massages before or after races? That's a personal preference. I got one yesterday. I don't like to get massages the day before, but I will get a massage after. What about you? Um, I really don't care. Just depending on how my body feels. Like I got one a day and was fine. I do the same as you. I do it the day before a meet. Or the two day days, before, two the days day before, before the meet, and then after a race. Mm-hmm. Yeah. I don't know. I just feel like doing them the day before. Sometimes they can make you flat. Man, what's the difference between running college and pro? College and pro. <laughs> <laughs> like, it's not the same. It's not the same. And you spend a lot of time saying, man, when I was in college, I did this or I trained this way. And I I won't say forget everything that you did in college because obviously what you did in college got you to where you are. I was buff in college. But <laughs> I was buff my whole life. No, I was but... buff. Like big. Like big. I lost. I don't know what happened. But, but um, yeah, it's not the same. It's it's definitely you to go to. way harder. I went to the University of South Carolina. <laughs> Did we all lean in at the same time? <laughs> How fast was Jenna in the hundred without any training? Without any, I, I don't know. I never <laughs> ran it when I'm not training. Okay, well, what did you? What was your PB when you went into Oregon? In high school, I ran eleven three. Dang. 
I only live at eight. <laughs> <laughs> and in uh, just in high school was her PB right eleven three. My PB is eleven two four, and I was like twenty six. Well, my PB is eleven twenty seven, but I went eleven eight in my senior year in yeah high school. <laughs> But I won though, so that's all that matters. That's all that matters. <laughs> <laughs> I won the win. How much time should you give yourself between a workout and a meet? Um, we work out up to two days or the day before a meet. Um, but obviously the intensity is different. Um, the day before a meet. Who do y'all hate running against? If you hate running against anyone, you shouldn't be running. Yep. You gotta. That's you, great. you gotta love the competition. Um, let me see if I can scroll back up to some of these questions we missed here. What's your favorite music? That's a good one. Who will tell them your favorite music? You want me to tell them my favorite music? Yeah, would you tell us in practice? What did I tell y'all in practice? I listen to everything. Well, let me not say everything, but I listen to hip hop, ratchet music, trap music, <laughs> R&B, dance hall, and soca. They say I have a lot of questions, but a lot of people asking questions. Oh, what's y'all's favorite music? I like trap music. I like everything. I don't really care. No, we need to know what kind of music you like. (laughs) Since you my complexion, we need to know. (laughs) Just give me some time. Just give me some time. (laughs) I live in Oregon. If you didn't run track, what other sport would you participate in? Volleyball. For sure. Oh, what other sport I would do? Mm-hmm. Uh, I would do football. Football? Football. <laughs> <laughs> Habib, you got to ask your questions. My favorite movie is Harry Potter. <laughs> Is Alice and Felix like Beyonce in the track and field world? <laughs> what do you mean by that? Yeah, she I definitely mean. doesn't act like Beyonce. I'll say that. Um, I would say for who Allison is, she could act a lot like snottier. But I mean, yeah, she's definitely not a diva. Um, and by let me clarify that because somebody's gonna be messy with that. When I say she's not a diva, she's not like she doesn't act like a stank person. She doesn't have a stank personality. She's not rude or anything like that. Um, Sharika is a cutie pie. She ain't that cute. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you. Who was that? Uh, Sean. Sean. Okay, thank you, Sean. I really do. Do y'all like men who wear rompers? <laughs> <laughs> that can't be a thing. <laughs> you know, I don't. I I don't mind it. If they can pull it off. Yeah, you can pull it off. See, I I like fashion. So if and and I the one that like took off was the Cam Newton one, which in all honesty, at first glance, I thought he had on like a matchy matchy two piece. I didn't realize that it was a romper. So, I mean, as long as it's not... They said they got hella rumpus, whoever that is. <laughs> <laughs> Send her a picture. You got to be what swagged about out. How would you feel if DeAndre wore one? Who? <laughs> 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 no. Um, I don't know. If he can swag it out. <laughs> Shut up, Taj. Where'd she go, man? <laughs> Did I say something I wasn't supposed to say? Like, nah. Okay. Nah. Jenna? Men and romper. Do you do you have a boyfriend? Mm-mm. I'm single. <laughs> We're both. <laughs> See, I have to include you in there to talk. Look, everybody know I'm single. You already threw me under the bus. Hey, Tasha, did you ever have a boyfriend? No. Gosh. <laughs> I thought this was a question. Uh, <laughs> How did you guys? Oh, that's a good one. How did you guys make your decision on what sponsor you want to run for? Jenna, go first. I always start on this end. Um, when I wanted to go pro, I guess I I was just talking to all the companies, and Puma was like super nice, and I I got along really well with them. So. They paid you that check. I mean, that, <laughs> I mean but, and notice she said she was talking to all of them. <laughs> 
I'm just saying. That check. That's all you gotta say. <laughs> they, I mean, they did. Yeah, they paid the bill. <laughs> they were like really quick. Look, that check. <laughs> <laughs> um, I went with Under Armour because. I was with another company before I was... I'm not going to name them because I just don't name them. But... Did um, you roll eyes? No, I didn't roll my eyes. Did you I? Don't, you just didn't know. You oh, rolled them. I, I do do that subconsciously. Mm-hmm. But anyway, um, so I was actually running for a year without a sponsor. Like, I ran for a full season with no sponsor. I was just running off of savings and whatever. And Under Armour knew that um, I was a free agent. And they expressed their interest. And actually, um, I want to say she's like the senior VP of marketing now. But she flew down to Atlanta to meet me personally because they wanted to make sure I was a good fit for the company. And I got a really good vibe from her. And I signed my contract on the set of my first photo shoot. And I've been with them since 2012. Yeah, 2012. Well, uh, mine is pretty simple. I was Adidas school, so I just went with Adidas. Oh, okay. I just wanted to go with Adidas because I heard a lot of um, bad stuff about other people. (laughs) (laughs) Moving on! (laughs) Uh, Who pays for the flights and meets? USATF and sponsors. So, for the track meets... um, Particularly meets like this, invitationals or diamond leagues, those meets would pay for our flights, our hotels. Um, yeah. But when we go to nationals, we have to pay for that. And then depending on... Am I giving too much information now? Depending on our rank, we get um, some money back. But... Oh. How do you know they get money back? Sorry. <laughs> Yo, agent must not mean, um, <laughs> you need to take that up with your agent. Man. Uh, you heard USATF was being cheap on us. Um, how so? Explain. The Olympics was a lifetime experience. I know my muscles are big, man. They've mm. been big ever since I was a kid. I don't even, I just look at the weights and I put on muscle mass. Thanks. Thank you for calling us beautiful. What does it mean to go pro as a track and field athlete when leaving school early? You get paid. <laughs> what's, the, what's the hardest workout? Oh, that's a good one because I always tell them my hardest workout. So now that I have two other events, what's your hardest workout? Let me start over here because I started over there. Hmm. Either like my 250 workouts or how many 250s will you do just like two all out 250s but like i think the hardest is the 180 150 120 all out we've done that we sure did and she bust my butt when we did those 180s what we do 180 150 120 no 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 it was 180 60 40, 40 120 20. and did we do 100 or nah, did we stop at 120 we didn't do 100 no, I don't think I would have been able to get <laughs> But let me tell y'all, for the 180, I only got one. She good. hopped out on me. Like, she took off. And I, I was like, oh, shoot. Like, let me catch her. So after that, I had to make sure I went on the whistle because. Balls to the walls every time. Like, come on, Tasha Roberts. Like, you ain't got to be this hard on me. Yes, I do. Like, yes, I do. <laughs> um, my hardest workout is six 500s, but we do that in the off season. Like, my, like, I hate off season training. Like, I forgot about off season. If we could just skip to, like, just wake up and be fast, please. But six 500s, hands down, and, and the rest is short, too. We only get, like, three minutes rest, and then we'll give us seven minutes after the third one, but that's that's, that's tough. Yeah, I have to agree with Tosh. My um, hardest workout is all fog training. Um, I just The be, whole thing, huh? The not whole even, thing. Like, not, not, not just a one <laughs> simple, no, the whole fog training. Like, I be in the back wheezing every time. <laughs> <laughs> so, like, At least you didn't pull 
your um <laughs> your asthma pump out. Oh <laughs> man. <laughs> man. Oh gosh. Okay. How many days a week did you run the five hundred? One day, man. Listen, <laughs> after them five hundreds, I'm done for the week. Hey, let me call you back. Um. Right. Uh, me and Sharika lift weights three days a week. Jenna, how often do I lift you? Lift it twice a week. Twice a week. What? Someone asked. Hey guys, don't don't be messy. Like that's just crazy. English Gardener is just fine. Is she mentally okay? <laughs> what is your sneezing? Yeah. <laughs> um. <laughs> wait, what is going on here? Did your thing just turn messy? I think so. I don't know what my max bench is. Um, we rest on weekends. I went pro in 2007. 2015. 2014. 14. 2000. So wait, was y'all in high school in 2007? Yeah. Yeah. I graduated in 2011. I graduated in 2009. <sighs> um, how does traveling internationally <laughs> affect your body and getting sick along with training? There is an art to traveling internationally. You have to stay on top of your vitamins, vitamin C, especially. You know, in some places, people don't cover their mouth when they sneeze and cough. You know, um, sleep is actually a big part of um, staying healthy while traveling too, allowing your body to regenerate. Um, yes, please. Thank you. Um, oh God, I'm gonna butcher your name, but Davis. thanks for getting them together, Davis. Me. Thanks. Like, don't be messy in these comments, guys. Um, yeah, so it's an art to traveling and staying on top of your health and taking care of your body. I don't speak any other language. I do. What Ratchet. <laughs> <laughs> My favorite country to attend a track meet is actually Qatar. Doha. Jenna? Hmm. I liked Switzerland and Monaco. Mm, Monaco like was Monaco, dope. But, uh, Monaco was dope. Switch for real, me. for real. <laughs> um, I can't find with food, man. Yeah. Why Qatar? I actually really like the culture and architecture in Qatar. So they just, um, they're really intriguing over there. Um, how do you adapt to the new time zones when you travel? Do you guys have any tricks? Well, I try to go to sleep on the plane, like whatever time it is over to the place that I'm going to. Most of the time Whoa, Tyler, okay, I'm kicking you out of here. Don't, okay, I'm sorry. I'm going to let you answer the question. But let me say this. Let me block Tyler. There it is right there. Um, us doing this is a gift to you guys. Like, we have a race tomorrow night. So please don't come in here being disrespectful. Like, real talk. You will get blocked. Okay. Um, go ahead. I forgot. <laughs> did you see that? Yeah, I did see that. <laughs> I forgot what I was saying though. Um, shoot, I oh, adjusting to the time zones. Oh yeah, yeah. So I try to go to sleep on the plane, whatever time it is, to the destination that I'm going to. So, um, for me, depending on the time that we race, dictates how I try, how or if I try to adjust to the time zone. So mm -hmm. like. If it's a short trip, say like last week when I went to China, it becomes more about, okay, what time of day do I run? So I need to make sure that my body is awake during that time of day. So it's not necessarily do I want to sleep through the night or that sort of thing. It's trying to make sure that my body adjusts to the time that I'll actually be competing. Mm -hmm. So sometimes that'll mean staying up till one two three o'clock in the morning the older i get that doesn't really work because i need my sleep but um yeah sometimes like just your kind of uh, why yeah uh, i can't see it and i'm like uh, uh. Um, <laughs> yeah sometimes i'm just like um i'll just sleep like when i when when i feel like i need to sleep i'll sleep um, but like if it's for a long trip where we're gone for like three weeks at a time, please I'll answer sleep. this question because I've seen or, this mood um, at one time. 
Um, my favorite leg is second leg. Jenna. I ran third leg all in college. Oh, you're a time runner? Mm-hmm. Hmm. So I like third leg. I like all the leg. They're all fun. Second leg's fun. Yeah, you can put me anywhere, but I like second leg, yeah. Um, Supplements. This video ain't sponsored, so (laughs) no free pub. Sponsored by Under Armour, Adidas, and (laughs) That's That's who gets the love on this video. Um, What do you guys do when you get nervous? I'll either, like, listen to music or just talk to my teammates or coach <laughs> just zone out she talked to the competition <laughs> my teammates no i'm kidding <laughs> oh my god Tosh. why did you do that you just made it no. what why would you say do you well i didn't know i was joking oh i'm sorry nervous in what way because i don't yeah. get nervous all the way up until like i'm actually on the line and they're about to shoot the gun, but I'm not nervous Ooh, up until that you point. You know what? That last five minutes is like, I don't know how to explain it. Because it's like different phases. Mm-hmm. It's like the morning of, you know, you have a little bit of butterflies. Then you go to the track and you're like, okay. Then once I start moving, then I start kind of calming down. But yeah. then when I hear that first call, I'm like, Ooh. Here we go. Yeah, I be too crunk. I be listening to. I be listening to push. <laughs> then when we get to the oh my on lord, repeat, <laughs> you, you be ready I to kill somebody. Be ready. <laughs> like, I be so ready. <laughs> then I get to the call room and I'm like, ooh. And then it's like depending on how the call room is, it's like all of our energies. They put us to sit down next to each other in these chairs, and I'm like, I really want to punch you in your face right now. <laughs> but they got me sitting right next to you. <laughs> Then you go out on yeah, and then you go out on the track and they play that. I don't. (laughs) They play that (laughs) intro music, and that's when it's like, oh, I gotta go. But it's like, it's crazy because you go through all of that, but then the gun goes off, and it's like, yep, it's all go. It all goes away. Yep. Uh, yeah, it's it's sick. Um. Okay. I like watching football. But I don't really watch yep, too much basketball. Yeah, push it like salt and pepper. Hey, <laughs> look at that. <laughs> That's my soul. Um, I'm running the 400. I think we're all doing our pet events. I'm running the 400. You're running hurdles. the 100 hurdles. Mm-hmm. You're I'm running, running the 100. The um, do you guys have... um? athletes that inspired you when you were growing up? Not me. I didn't really grow up on track and field, so... We are in Jamaica. So when did you start, um... I didn't, like, grow up watching it, but I started running track in middle school. Okay. What about you, Jenna? I'm the youngest in my family, so my brother and sister did it, so I grew up at track meets watching them. Hmm... Mm, that's a good question, Sharika. Yes, I was just saying that they need to give us a shuttle hurdle relay so that it can be six of us too. I'm all for that. The U.S. would dominate. I know that, it's but not that's not even fair. That's what I'm saying. Like, I'm just like. It's not even fair. It is fair. I mean, it is fair, but it is. The U.S. would kill everyone. Hey. <sighs> so like person. Somebody wants to see you flex too, Jenna. <laughs> she looked up. I don't have the guns out right now. <laughs> I don't have the do. guns out right now. <laughs> okay, I'm trying to scroll back and make sure I got all of these questions. Um, you guys should have someone read the comments while the others answer it. Oh, that's a good idea. Um, thanks, Donnell. Yes, Tyler does need a life, but he got blocked, so he good. What happened to your dog, Tosh? <laughs> Who asked me that? You have a dog? Who is Christian? <laughs> I do have a dog. She's with her granny, okay? <laughs> She's doing well. She's spending some quality time with my mom. You abandoned her? I did not abandon her. Wow. See, what had happened was, with my travel schedule, it just became a lot. And my brother went away to college, so I felt like my mom needed company. 
So was she happy that you gave her the dog? I mean, she tries to act like no. <laughs> but <laughs> secretly, she really loves the dog. She was already housebroken. She didn't have to train her. Yeah, Juicy's just fine. Jenna is a sweetheart, except for when she says she's the same complexion as me. Uh, <laughs> so, like, how does ProTrack work? Um, that's way too general. I don't know how to answer that. Um, I'm going to be running the 200 in Boston out on the street race. So, you'll get to see... Um, You'll see me run a 200. Hey, I think so too. I think I would look real nice in the Aston Martin. <laughs> real nice. Um, how do we feel about Sydney McLaughlin's success? I think it's dope. I wish, I think she'll have an awesome um, career going Kill forward. It. She is killing it for sure. Um, what are what your snaps? I ain't on Snapchat no more. Like, I'm on there, but I don't snap, so I'm not even going to bother. I don't even know what my snap name is. Insta story just took over. Like, I can't I can't do both. And then I'm vlogging, and it's just, I can. My Snapchat is hurdle underscore holic. That's all your social media. So if yeah. you want to find Sharika, hurdle, hur, hur, blah, 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 blah. <laughs> hurdle <laughs> underscore holic. Mine's J underscore Prandini. Simple. <laughs> do you guys still have those people no nobody asked well they don't ask me what my fastest time was oh yeah we are having a slumber party huh <laughs> Sharika best snaps in social media lol your snaps do be wildin hey y'all go follow the kid it's gonna be crazy tomorrow just kidding <laughs> I ain't got nothing to talk about She's not. She's not kidding. It is going to be crazy. No, it's not. These, what? It that, might be crazy tomorrow night. It's going tomorrow to be night. jam packed and loud and loud. Mm-hmm. Like the Jamaican fans are insane. I'm gonna have my phone on the line. Just kidding. <laughs> Please do not. Uh. All right, you guys that are asking um how to lower your times. I'm not ignoring you. I just don't know how to answer that question because it's like, are you asking me a workout question or I I just, I don't know how to. I think as long as like you get older, because I mean, that person said they were 14. Yeah. It'll eventually start dropping. And if you're serious about it, working hard. Yeah. Mm -hmm. I'm sorry, guys. I'm not trying to be, it's just. Somebody drive said, your "Drive your knees to where?" <laughs> <laughs> Those shoulders are about as broad as the subject on this little chat. Wow, wow, wow! That's clever. Very clever. <laughs> um, how much money you make? How much money you make, boss? <laughs> yes, we have the vibes favorite hurdle workout you with the headband what is your name how you asking what's my name and you on my channel (laughs) you're on my chat my live stream disrespectful (laughs) what race are y'all most disappointed about huh what does that mean what race are you most most disappointed about I don't know, like, what... That's a hard question. That's a hard... For me, it's a hard question, and I'm going to say why. Because after I have a bad race, I've said this time and time again, you have to have short-term memory. So after I've had a bad race, yes, you go over it. Well, I thought they were talking about, like, events, like, which race are we most disappointed? But they're talking about, like, after a race. That's how I took it. Oh, okay. Maybe, unless... No, that's probably how... No, that's probably what they were saying, but I was just a little... Um... But, yeah, you take from that moment what you need to learn from it and then move on to the next. Like, mm-hmm. you can't sit there and dwell about <laughs> the race. So, can I face the Tosh, go ahead. You ain't about to FaceTime me. <laughs> <laughs> they said they was for 
real. I know he was for real. That that wasn't even a, a sliding in the DMs. That was like a <laughs> that was a leap. <laughs> <laughs> he said, ha ha. <laughs> Too. I'm so serious. Um, have you guys ever had a major injury that caused a big setback, and how did you get through it? Sharika is the best dancer. Um, Jenna, can you dance? Can I dance? Yeah. No. I am not the best dancer. You got at white all. girl rhythm. Mm-hmm. Me too, girl. <laughs> Whatever. I do. Um, I do. I had uh, actually my freshman year of college. I pulled my right quad at indoor nationals in the final and that kind of put me out for a little bit and then my sophomore year I had bursitis in my right ankle and that had me out for like two months and then I haven't had anything major since then now I just try to be proactive get my treatment stretch cool down warm up all of the above you had any big injuries my base. I broke my foot my freshman year at college. My navicular, so I was out for like. How did you do that? I think the training was just so new, and um, coming from California, I didn't know that you're supposed to take vitamin D when you go to Oregon because the sun never shines. Hmm. So your bones get weak, and I learned the hard way. So my foot I just broke. Learned so I know. Too. I did too. Mhm. Hmm. It's like the first thing they make you do is. I thought you were gonna say you and English were like playing basketball in your dorm. And English that's kicked me, yeah. How my you foot. broke your foot? Yeah. <laughs> she said, "Yeah, the English kicked me out." Why would you just like say that? Because <laughs> her and English were roommates, and they said uh, they got into trouble together. Yeah, um, me and English were roommates. And what um did you have any injuries? I did um my hamstring in 2014, um, and I was so sad. Cause that was like my first ever, like injury. Um, Wait, was that the year you turned pro? Mm-hmm. I think I kind of remember that. I don't think we were cool yet, but I knew. Yeah, Natasha was who a little stink with me in 2013 when um, she saw me. Cause you know she was at a meet, and let me tell you all this story. Was at a meet. We was together where I won my race, so I'm thinking I'm like, okay, ooh. <laughs> so I'm, I'm seeing all of these professional athletes. Yeah, it's getting too much with the dishes. Oh, my bad. And so I'm the like, this must have got crazy. Go ahead. Oh, they somebody asked me my favorite workout again. I'll answer that in a few seconds. It's distracting when you read the. So just tell okay. your story. So <laughs> I'm, I'm seeing all of these professional athletes at this meet, and I'm like starstruck because I'm like, oh, these professional athletes. And so I'm like, I see a. One girl that I knew, and I asked her if she wanted to take a picture, but she was all with three up. Uh, there was three of y'all, right? So I'm like, oh, do all of you guys want to take a picture? Natasha just keep on walking, turns around. Oh, excuse me, what's going on? Oh, okay, little stink, stink, Tosh. But then we cleared that up. And we're good. Now we're the best of buddies. Yeah. I don't remember this, <laughs> just so we're clear. She's mean, y'all. I am not mean. Don't tell the people that. <laughs> like, Sharika, I'm can you mean. show your abs? No. Yeah, she she got some abs. For <laughs> real, for I real. can't, though. You know you can't. <laughs> <laughs> but she got some abs. <laughs> um, okay. <laughs> if, if I could change, if you could change your specialty race, what would it be? I would change to the 200. Jenna? Mm. I don't know what I'd change it to. Definitely not a distance event. <laughs> I mean, right. I'd say, For sure. I'd stay in the sprints, I think. Pole I would, would do. Be cool. Yeah, I would do high jump. Pull vault. Y'all I'd crazy. I'm vault. scared of heights. My favorite hurdle workout, all of them. I love hurdling all the time. That's Thank all I want to do. Um, you're the fastest. Uh, Oh, I like that, Donnell. You're right. No negative talk. Positive thoughts going into tomorrow. I don't know any track teams in D.C. Can any of you guys sing? Mm. <laughs> <laughs> nope. <laughs> I mean, I can sing, but I can't sing good. Like, What? 
Oh my gosh. Blood on his stomach. Wait. What? Okay. Block. Um. Block. What they say? Um. You said raise my ass. What? I don't know. What are your? Uh, okay. Did we? Um. I think I went back. The funny. <laughs> I know you got stories. What's the funniest mm. moment you've ever had at a meet? I don't know. I don't know for that. You just fell last week. Girl, that wasn't funny. <laughs> yes, it was. You posted it on Instagram. Nah, that wasn't funny, though. I still got a sore right here. Oh, that's what that is. Yes, it wasn't funny. <laughs> it was just because I had a little okie doke in the track, but it wasn't funny. Like, it hurt. Mm, my funniest moment? I mean, I've fallen a couple of times too i fell la- i fell twice last year actually in i 400 yes i fell hmm? at indoor national <laughs> in the final my legs was tired my legs was like girl bye you fall at the finish line yes oh, okay. both times and then at trials i fell after the finish line I'll but that. it looked like i dived for the line but i, I was just problem yeah, and yep, people, you feel too people think too. you're diving for the line. It's like, no, my legs were like, girl, bye. I'm done. No, nah, I would do that though if I was like, if I knew like I could dive and win the race. <laughs> See, they asked me on like a couple weeks ago, they asked me about the whole Shawnee thing. Mm-hmm. And I'm like, I don't think she dived or did that on purpose. I don't like, care. I'm, if, I'm, <laughs> if I'm next to her and I see her diving, I'm diving too. I don't care. I don't care. I don't want to hear. We going to be diving together. Whoever wins, that's who going to win. Do what you got to do. Huh? You got to do what you got to do, man. Yeah, I... I... I just fell, but anyway. <laughs> y'all be diving for that check. Yup, because we get a bonus for the medals too. Sure <laughs> um, what are you guys' thoughts on mixed relays? I think the mixed relay idea is actually dope. I think it, it was made for the fan, and I think um, it's definitely something to bring more people, especially American fans, to the sport. So I think it's, it's pretty dope. I like it. I ran the 400 one time in college. I was pretty okay. But you won't see it ever again. <laughs> what type of guys do you date? Do they have to be athletes, Jenna? Mm. I don't, they don't have to be, but everyone that I have dated has been, so. We look alike. They're talking about me and her. <laughs> <laughs> Natasha, no, 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 no. Get away from the question. What type of guys you like? <laughs> I've already said it a million times. There's a whole video on here of why I'm single. Um, I like manly men. Um, and by manly, I mean <laughs> like somebody from the East Coast. No, actually, I don't. Ironically enough, being from New York, I don't really like New York guys. Hmm. It don't have to be New York. Um, but I, I do like men from like down south. Um. For some reason, a few of my boy, well, a few, I've only had a couple of my boyfriends, a couple of boyfriends, but I have a liking for Florida boys. I don't know why. Hmm. Um, Florida boys over here. <laughs> I like, I like them. I want them God fearing, of course. I like them really, 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 really dark. I like dark. When chocolate. did you realize you were lit? Every day we lit. <laughs> you guys <know> me? <laughs> um, I don't know. I feel like that's it. Um, yes, I've only dated athletes. I don't think I've ever dated a civilian. I have. A civilian. Have you? In college I did. And actually... Like, yeah, I have too. Yeah, I didn't think we were going to be together because he didn't have any abs. But eventually I got over it. <laughs> <laughs> no, that's like a real thing though. No, because no, even yes. at my age now, I'm like... I'm looking at some guys and I'm just like, I can't look. Y'all look at me. Y'all asking me to flex, right? You can't be stronger than that. I can't be stronger than my dude. You know what I mean? So I do kind of run into that, but I'm like, okay, you know, someday these are going to sag and I'm not always going to look like this. So I can't, you know, put that pressure on my man to be like, pow, pow, you know, but for the time being, you can it's hard like that's that's the part that's like hard with dating a civilian like i'm super fit and 
you're a civilian. No <laughs> offense to the civili- civilians, but you know. Fit girls look best. Yes, we do. Y'all want to eight- date an actor from the Bahamas. Hint, hint, me. me. <laughs> <laughs> Everyone has abs. What does it take to be an Olympian? And what times do I have to run to make the Olympics in the 400 and tips? And Jenna, I want to go to Oregon so bad. So what times do I have to run for them? I mean, that's a hard question. Yeah, that is a I mean, loaded question. I mean, do you want to go to Oregon to get a scholarship, or do you want to go to Oregon and, like, just be on the team? Because you can go to Oregon and walk on. <laughs> you can? You can walk on. You can walk on anywhere. Yeah, you can I walk on. I'm, listen, that, I don't That know. wasn't your experience. That, that wasn't no, your I'm ministry. Just saying, I don't really think, I didn't think Oregon, like, allow people to walk on. Yeah, we have walk-ons and stuff. I like, think by, um... I was about to say by law, but I think by NCAA standards, you have to allow some walk-ons. Oh. Yeah. And then okay. they usually want walk-ons because the walk-ons are usually the ones that keep the, the GPA hardest. up. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> they said uh, a scholarship for track. A scholarship? Mm-hmm. I mean, you have to be like top in the nation, yeah. especially for like big schools like Oregon. Um, they just try to give the scholarships to, like the best kids in the nation. So let me say this too though Because I'm seeing comments like I want to go pro I want to go pro Everybody is focused on this like Money and like going pro And and don't get me wrong Important yes we all want to live We all want to have a nice lifestyle But that cannot be your focus guys Like you have to focus on Whatever your passion is what, Obviously with this This chat I'm assuming it's track If you're in school, whatever, you have to be focused on your passion, develop that. And then the money, the pro, the whatever, it'll all come. But if you're focused on that, you're you're starting off on the wrong foot already. What? Yes, focus on the process. Which question is for Sharika? Who is Shakira? Uh, you going to be in Eugene? When? Next weekend? Yeah, I'll be there. I'm running the 200. So Jenna's going to be at... Um... What question was he Okay, about? let me scroll back up. Are you going to... Um... Pre? I am. I'm the only one who's not um, going to Pre. Uh... Buy a GoPro. Huh? Okay. Wait, I think it's right there. That one. 53, 7 or 400 hurdles as a freshman in college? Is that a... Oh, that's, that's a guy, a... huh? Oh. Is that a guy? Because I was going to say I a guy. So. a girl. That's a girl. Right? <laughs> <laughs> uh, you know, we're national. <laughs> <laughs> Are you going to answer the question? Who? Me? That's for you, they said. What? No, that's not the same person. That's yes, a, it that's is. For, it is the same What did they person? say? About the 400 hurdles. I didn't, I didn't read the whole thing because I didn't know that question was for me. <laughs> Why ask me about 400 hurdles? I don't know. Um, That's not the same person. It is the same person. <laughs> That's not a person. <laughs> <laughs> AKA, she don't want to answer that question. No, I, don't, I, don't, I don't know how to answer that question. Uh, Jenna, how did you heal your broken leg? I was in crutches for like eight weeks, Damn. which sucked in the rain at Oregon. And then I was in a boot. It took almost like a year for me to get it back to normal. And then you came back running 22 too, huh? Then I can, uh, it was a year after that. How hard was the transition from high school to college? Um, how hard was it? I think it was pretty. Um, I think it was pretty easy. Um, I didn't have really no. Um, I don't know. It was an easy transition. <laughs> 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 Me, man. It was. Hey. It really was. But the only thing I had like coming out of um, <laughs> high school, going into college, was I felt like a lot of people were a lot more faster, um, and I was getting whooped my freshman year. But that's it. Like, 
Yeah, that's the hardest thing. Yeah. Um, D, you know Mitch? <laughs> Sorry. Um, have I ever thought about changing my race plan? Nope. Um, any national my race plan tips? changes every every time I run. Um, any natural hair tips? Um, conditioner is your best friend. Deep conditioner, especially if you're colored or bleached like moi. Um, drink lots of water and take your vitamins. You girls are crazy. Uh, listen, I train with her every day. <laughs> and I told her, I'm sure she was that kid that... <laughs> you know when somebody cracks a joke on someone mm -hmm. and it's like the joke is already like I don't say mean but it's kind of like halfway there her laugh mm -hmm. <laughs> will be the reason why you want to fight the person <laughs> who no, made the joke they want to fight me cause I'm laughing <laughs> like god I didn't even say it cause you laugh it. so hard I didn't even say it I would be like dang what do. Oh my god, I don't know what you're supposed to answer. With, they how are you supposed like, to feel about Elaine Thompson? They, like, they ask you like a 20,000 times. 20,000 times. She's fast. I mean, she's, a, she's fast. <laughs> she's killing it. I don't, I don't know what else they want me to say. <laughs> I don't I don't know, Neil. Uh, yeah, Jenna, you're not in the frame. They want, they want to see your beautiful face. What's my favorite show? My favorite show is Housewives of Atlanta, honey. I'm sorry. Trash. Well, that's a good question for you. Which one? This one? The Usain Bolt one. Oh, yeah. I mean, it, that was crazy. We didn't practice at all. Get in the frame. I don't stink. I took a bath today. <laughs> <laughs> Jenna with the shade again. Jenna with the shade. No, um, no that, was, that was crazy because we didn't really practice that much. And so my steps were like... You had to give him like 45 steps. I gave him 50 steps. <laughs> and I probably could have still gave him way more than that. I would have freaked out looking yeah. because he's not a small guy and then he's coming towards he's just coming you. At, he's just coming at you so much so faster. Fast. Than yeah. Overall. So yeah, it was crazy. But it was fun. Can't imagine. <laughs> you don't stink, Tasha. <laughs> um, why are you an Under Armour athlete? I think you already yeah, I did answer that. He came to the um, the chat a little late. You want to be original. <laughs> yeah, some so some of these questions are starting to repeat. Uh, what are the plans after running is over? Well, I'm gonna become a stripper. <laughs> <laughs> I'm just kidding. I'm just kidding. <laughs> Please clean that up, like now. <laughs> no, I'm kidding. Um, so after after track for me, I am, um, I guess I started, but I want to go into my um, major. But I think I'm gonna start doing it before I actually get finished with track. What kind of journalism did you? Photojournalism. Okay. Yeah. Oh, that makes sense now. Go don't say nothing about no pictures, Tasha. <laughs> Cause I want to hear it tonight. Jenna, I don't know yet. I'm still trying to figure it out. I would like to have a family, so hopefully my husband finds me before I decide to retire. Cause like family is like number one. Somebody said you go shrieking on my list of um. <laughs> I know they went ham with that stripper comment. Um. I yeah. can't dance, y'all. I'm not gonna be a stripper. I ain't got no titties. You ain't gotta dance. Weed. You just know how to swing. Know how to swing around the pole. That's I don't know easy. how to swing around the pole. I have a pole. You though. can learn. Um, I was taking pole dancing classes. <laughs> but my man's. Um. Thank you. Biggest race goals for the season. <laughs> Did you read that one too? Yeah. <laughs> um, biggest race goals for the season. I mean, it's always the same for me. Make the team and then make yeah. the podium. Get to London. Yeah, but you gotta. You can't. How do they say it? What's the What's the? You can't. Um. 
the one of my mom's saying is is escaping me now. You have to walk. You have to crawl before you walk. You gotta get to get through the trials and then get to London. Oh shoot, guys, we're at an hour. Okay, so we'll, oh, it's yeah. yeah. So we'll take a couple more questions, and then um, and then we're gonna wrap this up. Um, you shall not pass is the message given. What? <laughs> <laughs> uh, my uterus is condemned. <laughs> block. <laughs> my degree is in print journalism. Oh, so you can take the pictures and he can print them. <laughs> <laughs> Who was that? Chris Harris. <laughs> Make your coins, however, you have to win judging. <laughs> oh, God. Four times five, 500 twice a week? I'm sorry. I really feel like you should only do that once a week. Gotta change coaches. Yeah, that's brutal. Sharika, is any, are any of us sneakerheads? No, I'm a... Um, oh, shoot. I was about to say... A wee head. I meant a weave. Weave. <laughs> weave head, not a sneakers head. <laughs> it almost. <laughs> it's, I'm not a sneakers head. Team Candy, so. of course. Are y'all assigned I, rooms? What do you mean by that? I do remember when um, Kenya called Portia Elvis. Um, we are assigned rooms, so you can imagine how excited I was when I walked in and I saw Jenna as my roommate. Who's your roommate? I told you who my roommate was earlier today. Don't make me repeat it. Obviously, she's not as excited as I am. Um, okay. We were roommates last meet, or last year at this meet, were we? Were we? I think we were. One of one of the one of the means we were roommates. I remember. I feel like it was here. My room, my room, kind of smells weird. Thank you, Donnell. You have to creep before you walk. Don't count your chickens before they hatch. Yes, there we go. I could not get you that. You definitely didn't say all of that. Yeah, you no, talked but, about crawling and then. Walking. Yeah, no. Yeah. But remember, I was saying that I was trying to remember <laughs> uh-huh. something that my mom says, but I couldn't remember it, and she said it for me. Okay, this is the very last question. I think this is a good one to end on. What's your favorite thing to splurge on? Like, are we talking food or like buying something? Like buying something. Yeah, just. Mm. Honestly, uh, get in the frame. I think my favorite thing to splurge on. I have two little nephews, and so I, I always buy them a lot of stuff. She's about to make me sound like the devil. Yeah, you go last, <laughs> cause it's yours. Mine is real simple here. That's it. <laughs> Mine is shoes. <laughs> so you like to spend your money on your nephews. <laughs> so sweet. You are just so, so, so sweet. sweet. Oh my gosh. I can't believe it. Well, actually, shoes and cars. I mean, yeah. I, okay, yeah. baller. Trigger, you drive a nice car, too. It's okay. But you, like you said, like I just said, well, I'm just going to go buy this BMW because I want to You said cars. Yeah, right. With an S. Well, no, I have one car, but I like a nice car. So that that is a splurge. Yeah. I guess so. And I am a car girl. So we all like cars. We are really. We're fast girls that like fast things. You drive a fast car. I know, I do. Oh, I almost got a ticket too one time. But I, I need to get a radar. Anyway, so we're rambling. Thanks for tuning in. If you're not subscribed, make sure you're subscribed. You'll see more of this one for sure. Jenna, I don't know how much more. You for know, again. I know if we're ever roommates again, maybe at World Championships, because we're gonna we are gonna speak that into existence. All three of us will be there. And yeah, so subscribe, give me some thumbs up. I see some there already. And I'll catch you next time. Bye, guys. Bye. Thanks. Bye.